What's up my peeps, it's time to choose which team I'm going to fight for in the People's Champion Challenge. It's Team Daniel Bryan versus Team Roman Reigns. I don't think I clarified last time which team I'm going to fight for. Well, I'm going to be fighting for Team Daniel Bryan. It doesn't really matter though because Team Daniel Bryan is winning anyways. I mean, at the moment, it's not that big of a difference, but usually whichever superstar starts to win in the beginning ends up winning in the end. Um, I remember the first People's Champion Challenge though, which I think was Brock versus John Cena. That one might have been the exception where it kind of went back and forth for a while. But then I think since then, the People's Champion Challenge, whoever gets like the starting lead, ends up winning in the end. Anyways, I haven't played any matches yet in the People's Champion Challenge. This was my first... Well, you guys saw, I just picked my freaking team there. <laughs> the superstar I'm going to fight for. But anyways, the King of the Ring is finished, and the Fusion Chamber is also finished. So, first thing I'm going to do is I'm actually going to check the King of the Ring. This is the King of the Ring where I made it to the quarterfinals because that other guy was sleeping or something like that. And then I gave up in the quarterfinals. I didn't try. I, I just, you know, left the game. And uh, so, we're guaranteed to be in the quarterfinals. That's where I'm going to end up at. I'm not going to be in the finals. And I think somebody in the comments section actually said that he was in my King of the Ring. Uh, I think he said he was savage. So let's see how you did, man. All right, so you made it to the semifinals, but you got destroyed by the destroyer himself, the beast, Brock Lesnar. And then I got beat up also by TN90. Except, can you say that you didn't try? No, I'm kidding, man. <laughs> I didn't try here. Uh, of course, you know, I tried in the quarterfinals, and the guy wasn't even there. Then we made it to the semifinals. And let's see who won. I, yeah, destroyer won. So destroyer won TN90. Anyways, uh, let's go ahead and check the reward I got. Uh, what, whichever re reward I'm going to get, I'm probably going to use it in the, what's it called? The Fusion Chamber. Unless maybe I get a, a card I've already got. Because if I can pro a card, then maybe I'm going to keep that card. We'll see. So, claim reward. And let's see which legendary card we get. And it is Shawn Michaels. So I don't have the Shawn Michaels card. I'm assuming it's a good card, because it's HBK, Shawn Michaels, <laughs> and when I run, run into HBK cards, they've got pretty high stamina, I mean, not stamina, freaking uh, charisma, so uh, this is, this should be a good card, I don't think I'm going to discard this one, uh, anyways, let's go ahead and proceed to the fusion chamber, because I want to see which card we got here, and so we can start our survivor fusion, because that's, that's going to take a couple days. So, it is... Let's find out here. It is... Okay, so that's the support card. Yeah, that's the support card. So, it's a manager, classy Freddy Blassie, 18 plus to all stats in deck. Alright, so we're going to take that. And we're going to go ahead and go to the epic... Not an epic, uh, Survivor Fusion here. We're going to use it right away. And we're going to go ahead and use two Ultra Rares... So, let me find some Ultra Rares here that I haven't leveled up. Uh, I didn't know I had a Bobby Heenan one. That's weird. Okay. Um, I might just use the Bobby Heenan one. Uh, I'm thinking, yeah, I think I'm going to use Bobby Heenan and Rick Rude, maybe. Uh, or should I do that? Yeah, I'm going to do that. We're going to go ahead, Bobby Heenan. Uh, or should I avoid the support cards? Because I don't, maybe if I pick too many support cards, I'll end up getting a support fusion. Because I don't want that. I don't want another, you know, Freddy Blassie right here. I want, uh, you know, a Superstar Fusion card. So, you know what? We're going to go the Superstar route here. I'm going to go with Rick Rude. And I'm going to go with Andre. Uh, hopefully this is a good decision. Now, oh, hold on a second. Now, since this is the Fusion one, I'm going to go with a stronger card here. We've got HBK, so we're going to use HBK. And, uh, yeah, so yeah, it's gonna be HBK and Andre the Giant. And then for this, okay, we need an epic card. Um, I guess it's time for me to get rid of my RVD card. Because it seems like the Cesar card is just better overall. So, we're gonna discard our RVD card. And right here, we need a, oh, damn it, we need a Survivor card. So, I think it's time for me to get rid of the Roman Reigns card here. Unfortunately, I can't pick it right now because it's in Exhibition, so how about I exit out of this? We're going to go into Exhibition here. And hold on, waiting on Network. Swap out this card with... 
I guess we'll go back to the good old legendary Randy card. There we go. I like this card. Helped me out a lot. So, same with the Hogan card, but the Randy card, I've had it longer. Uh, so yeah, let's go back to the chamber here. I guess we're going to have to restart the whole thing, or you know, we're going to have to repick the cards again. So, Freddy Blasi. Um, hold on a second. RVD. And here we're going to go with HBK. Uh, not the leveled up one, but the non-leveled up one. And we're going to go with Andre the Giant. We're also going to go with, for a legendary card. Okay, I just got the HBK one. Um, damn, man, which one should I pick? Okay, I'm pretty sure the HBK one ends up being better than the Daniel Bryan one. But do I want to get rid of my Daniel Bryan card that I did, you know, level up and all of that? I'm thinking about maybe getting rid of this Daniel Bryan card, even though I did max it out. Um, I don't know, I just feel like keeping the, the HBK card. I'm not sure what to go, but honestly, um, if I do ha want to have multiple fusion cards anyways, I'd ha I'm gonna have to, you know, sacrifice or use a bunch of these legendary cards that I have level leveled up, because the only one I haven't leveled up so far is the HBK one. Uh, so... It's either I pick the HBK one or the Daniel Bryan one. I don't need two, you know, uh, right blue triangles. Um, so, which one's it going to be? Daniel Bryan, HBK, I don't even know. I know the HBK one, once maxed out, is going to be better than the Daniel Bryan card. But, do I? am I going to spend some time to level him up? That's the question. I don't know if I will. So, I'm not sure what to do here. Last time, we sacrificed the Ultimate Warrior card over the Undertaker card. Even though the Ultimate Warrior card would have would have ended up being better than the Undertaker card if I did spend some some, some time leveling it. Level, level, damn, I can't... Uh, if I did, you know, max it out. Ah, oh, damn it, this is a tough choice. And even the network is waiting on me right now. They're like, come on, make your damn choice. Okay, I'm gonna go with Zenny O'Brien, maybe... Ah, man, I have, a, I have a tough time getting rid of a card I maxed out. But I just got the HPK card, man. You know, and we're going to go with Daniel Ryan. Might be a mistake, might not be. Whatever, man, I'm going to get a freaking Survivor Fusion out of this, so it's, it's, it's all good. And right here, I'm going to have to pick a card I maxed out because all my Survivor cards that I will sacrifice or any, any of the ones I could consider sacrificing are all maxed out. I'm definitely not going to give away the Road to Glory Nikki Bella cards. So, of course, we're going to go with Mr. Believe That, Roman Reigns. So, Reigns, Freddy Blassie, Rob Van Dam, Daniel Bryan, HBK, Andre the Giant. This better give me something good, man. Let me, let's me let see the rewards one more time here for the Survivor Fusion. We've got John Cena. I'm, I'm betting the John Cena card is really good. Uh, we've got Roman Reigns. Let's see here. Which one's better? Uh, you know, we're going to take a quick glance here. I, damn it. Can I go in the middle? Okay, there we go. So, power. Roman Reigns beats him in power by, like, um, how, how many points? By, uh, 34 points in, uh, toughness. Uh, he beats him in toughness, too. Uh, I, I don't know about toughness, though. Why would, um, they should have made, like, John Cena and Reigns maybe equal in toughness or something. Anyways, uh, speed. Roman Reigns beats John Cena in speed as well. Damn, he beats him in power, toughness, and speed. Uh, as, and as far as charisma goes, John Cena beats him, but by, by, by just by, like, a little amount. Wow. So the, the Roman Reigns card is actually... Oh, no, wait a minute. What? what? Dude, I was, I'm was i tripping, man. Uh, the, okay, wait a minute. Roman Reigns does not beat John Cena in power. John Cena card has the advantage in power. I don't know. Sorry, guys. I'm sleepy. Okay, so the John Cena card is better in power and charisma. Roman Reigns is better when it comes to toughness and speed. And then you've got Dean Ambrose, you've got Daniel Bryan, you've got Nikki Bella, and you've got the manager card. Alright, so I want either John Cena, Roman Reigns, Dean Ambrose, or Daniel Bryan. Uh, as far as the Nikki Bella card, because already, I've already got the Road to Glory one, and right now I really need a... A, a really good superstar survivor card, you know, something close to something that could beat a legendary pro at least. And so, you know, end of the superstar card should do it. Uh, preferably, I'd want Daniel Bryan or 
uh, John Cena since they are blue triangles. But I could also make Dean Ambrose work since he is a yellow uh, bottom triangle. So I could team him up with, I believe, uh, Titus O'Neil. So we'll see what we get. Um, anyways, time to do this. It's going to take four days, so we better get started. All right, activate Fusion Chamber. <laughs> there we go. All right, it's done. We lost our Roman Reigns card. So, that's about it, and it looks like Danny, Team Danny Bryan is still winning, uh, although, you know, there's still a chance maybe that Team Roman Reigns catches up. I'm going to go ahead and compete in the People's Champion Challenge. Uh, well, first off, I've got to set up my deck for it, because right now I just took got rid of the Roman Reigns card, and I've got to set up my deck in a way to get, you know, the most amount of points for the People's Champion Challenge, so... I think that's going to be it for this video. I showed you guys King of the Ring, showed you guys the Legendary Fusion card that I got, and showed you guys the uh, Survivor Recipe, Survivor Fusion Recipe. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, as always, you can click that like button down below. With that said, I'm out. See ya.